Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well today. And in this video, we are continuing with the theme of 2023 planner lineup. So this would be my, I guess, third planner. Um, yeah. So this is going to be my business planner for the upcoming year. And I'm just going to talk to you more into depth about how I'm going to be using it, what I did, what I changed, and all that kind of stuff, good stuff. And I hope you stay tuned. <music> you might know me from instagram as a cosmic planner and basically what we do here is we plan um we have some plan with me videos we talk about planners talk about stickers and everything planner related i'm sorry if you hear like background noises i'm not really um focusing on editing these videos so you might hear my kids or just like some weirdo racing down the street but yeah so anyways i just want to get into this planner and talk it through because there is a lot going on here so this is um the gold and black planner from the fall release that happy planner came out with and it was a horizontal planner and um i was originally going to use it for my lettering but um i love these the dividers they were like really uplifting and kind of like um achieve your goal type of um quotes i guess like this one stay humble work hard you are worth it all so like it's more like you know achieving your goals and just just trust the journey like that kind of stuff it kind of got me thinking that this could be my um business planner but i obviously had to change the layout and i did a bunch of friends and planning and stuff like that so you know i'm gonna walk you through that so first we have these couple pages which is you know the title page here obviously that's gonna go I'm going to um, put my shop name and not my name. So, that's that. And then, these pages, I probably think they will stay blank. But these pages, I might use for release um, days. And, like, release dates and stuff. And same here. I might just, you know, highlight release days just to give me an idea of what is happening. And, yeah. But, yeah. So, these pages might be, you know... A little more in depth about release days and stuff like that and the currently page um, i'm not sure how i'm going to be using the currently page i haven't gotten to that part if i am going to even use the currently page but it's there so i might i might you know think of something in the middle of when i am trying to plan everything out for this so yeah but then this page again i said in the previous video i don't use this um area so i probably might i'm not Think, yeah, so I'm not thinking I'm going to decorate this planner too much, but I might just, you know, add a couple of stickers here and there. And this um, planner, I obviously need to redate because I took this out from an undated extension pack and I put it in here. And, um, yeah, so on my monthlies, I plan out, um, on my monthlies, I plan out, like, the whole month of, um, where I need to be, what day, and stuff like that. And what, when is release week, when is time for me to you know send out um a pr package which i'm thinking about doing next year so i'm going to be getting into that in this planner so how i want to have it is um let's say my release day is friday over here which um i've decided to get like um a better schedule on this and rather not be all over the place so i'm probably going to have like every fourth friday of the month is going to be a release day so i'm going to do that and the whole week i'm just gonna be you know focusing on what i need to do for that release date and stuff like that like if i need to post a video i'm gonna have that in here and all that kind of stuff and then for each week i'm gonna post i'm gonna write down like where i should be like if i'm making four sticker sets then i should be at two sticker sets here i should be at listing um listing photos here and stuff like that so it's just gonna be like a huge timeline for the month and then i've switched out this planner entirely and i created my own so this is still from the extension pack and it's just like um the basic um list and stuff like that so this is going to get transformed into more of a monthly checklist um get it done kind of stuff like that and hold on if you've seen the happy planner um monthly layout they have some habit trackers on there so i incorporated that into the site it's a brain dump, brain dump area and something that i need to be um 
or uh, for the next month and this uh, that's gonna be like the top priority kind of thing going on here and uh, yeah that's basically this it's like a monthly view kind of page here and this is just for the whole month and then we get into the weeklies which is like this so it's like a huge checklist for the whole week and then there's just like bringing up ideas for um like just mapping out what i want to do and stuff like that and then here it's like i left this area for notes like if i wanted to um how would i say this like if i wanted to write specifically about um something or like sketch something maybe that would go here and then for this here there would be like a little checklist of what i need to do every day if i need to send orders i would have to do that and um yeah basically that is what this whole planner is about and this one here is like this is next week which is basically for things i need to do next week or like things that i didn't get done this week that i have to shift over to next week and just stuff like that and then here it's like my orders that i have coming in or going out if i need to send out a pr package a listing photo whatever is going on so that all that kind of good stuff if i need to cut stickers if i need to i don't know package something and just like that that is what this planner is basically for and then it goes out throughout the whole month like that there's nothing really different about it like this and then this play page is just a blank like i said I don't really have a use for a currently page, so but that one was part of um, this, so I kind of just left it. But here, you know, I took it out. And then yeah, then we go on to February, and we're just gonna go throughout the whole planner like that. And I do plan on using this to its extent because I think it'll be really helpful. So um, yeah, it'll be really helpful just to map out what I need to do each week. And basically give me, I guess, check it points? Yeah. So I can stay up to date with my business and everything like that. Because I do plan on um, converting my the Cosmic Planner um, Etsy store to my art store and just having like everything underneath the one brand, which would be better. And then the Cosmic Planner would just be like a planning account where I get to be in contact with you guys and everything like that so this is going to be my business planner for next year let me know what you think in the comments below and i hope you enjoyed this video stay tuned for the next one it's going to be my faith planner and yeah if you did like this video i hope you subscribe and just you know um continue with me on to the next year and i hope you have a happy and healthy day happy planning bye